Hello guys, um, I'm going to show you what I got at the IKEA yesterday. Um, they were closed for about six months. It's over the September. So uh, they started uh, closing when uh, the pandemic, uh, when it was declared as a pandemic here around March. But I haven't been to um, to IKEA since I already got what uh, I wanted. Uh, well, most of it we got our kitchen table. I had one thousand dollars, and I did not know how much money I had left. I forgot about it, and then I found out when um, after I bought all this stuff that I had set two hundred seventy six dollars left, and I spent almost half of what I had there in my um, gift card uh, had I known I would have bought uh, some stuff uh, for our bathroom that's what I needed to get because our bathroom is old and it needs um, a new um, mirror so I was looking for mirrors yesterday but at the food section this is what I got I got the apple cider which was about two dollars so I had to get something cold to drink and then this is the lingonberry spread and bilberry spread organic it says so I haven't tasted bilberry but I had lingonberry yesterday I bought um, your Swedish uh, meatballs it had lingonberry spread and um, uh, mashed potatoes to go with it okay so this one is packaged in a, like a gift box so um, I might get another one of this as a gift I might taste one That was um, six fifty dollars, six forty nine. This one is their chocolate. It's about a dollar each. This one is hazelnuts. I might just give this, uh, put this in the balik bayan box. We don't. I don't really eat chocolates now, but um, I got the uh, dark chocolate bar. I opened last night to give to my husband and I tasted some of it it doesn't say how many um, percentage of chocolate so one dollar each this is um, their uh, black tea bergamot and oak flavored it's organic these are in package as um, tea bags so I use this for for drinking but um, I only get organic uh, tea when I make um, kombucha so I need six pack six six packets for um, a, a gallon jar of kombucha so it didn't say how many uh, Tea bags are there. Well, twenty-five tea bags. Okay, so they'll give me several gallons. I also got their um, organic flavored and spiced black tea. So this one I need six teaspoons to make a kombucha. To make a gallon uh, jar of kombucha. And this one I don't it's a uh, sparkling apple and lingonberry flavor drink they have several flavors since it's sweet I don't usually um, buy sweet stuff but um, I get them once in a while that will be my sugar um, intake and it has 37 grams of sugar
probably the only thing that I did I don't really I did not really need but I haven't had um, lingonberry sparkling apple before so I wanted to try it so um, this one I bought there's like two in a package it wasn't that expensive it's um, That how much this was but um, I'm going to put I'm going to use one and make a sauce with mayo and uh, ketchup or make I'm going to look for a recipe for like a yum yum sauce and put it here so it's easy to dispense and then the other one I'm going to use for uh, making pancakes I'm going to put the pancakes inside so it's a uh, easier to uh, make my pancakes. I usually make gluten-free pancakes. This one I bought as a gift for my husband. He wanted a uh, dispenser for his um, apple cider vinegar which he he drinks um, with water for um, to stabilize his stomach. It's a um, health drink and the other one I'm going to use to, uh, to dispense um, olive oil or coconut oil. You can take about a teaspoon of uh, teaspoon or tablespoon of coconut oil, uh, organic coconut oil in the morning if you're doing keto diet. I don't always get to drink it. I don't. I don't like the flavor, but my husband puts it in his coffee, and um, he uses coconut milk as well as a creamer for his coffee. I forgot how much was this. This one is a, a scoop for making coffee. You can put the coffee in here and then you can steep that one. And this one you can use for scooping um, ground coffee. I guess this would be one scoop. And then you can use it to steep coffee, this one. This is the French uh, press coffee maker. I used to have one of these. It was about twelve dollars. This one is only about nine dollars. So what you need to do is just put the coffee grounds in there, put water, and then cover it and don't press it for a while. Let it steep and then when it's ready, then you press it down, and then you can dispense. You can also use this for um, loose leaf tea, so make your tea. So I'm yeah, surprised it was actually cheaper than the one that I um, got at the uh, Home Goods, uh, which was broken when I made coffee during camp. So I had to get another one and re replaced it. This one is a whole package. It's a uh, you know, for baking and making cake. It's only six dollars for all three. This one, I don't have a piping bag. You can always use Ziploc bags, but um, I needed a tip, so it comes with this one, which is a cake slicer. You can. It has this notch here to move how high you want your cake to be. And I just put that in there. This one is for the icing, for icing, decorating icing, and for the plain one here. So I bought um, gluten free cake mix. I used to bake gluten free um, 
biscuits and cakes before but um, I don't really have time for that I only have time now because I'm not working <laughs> this one the art of lace mats that I bought there's six of them it's about 50 cents each so I get six I wanted a place mat that's um, neutral in color and easier to clean they have several choices there they have the cloth ones but the cloth after you wash it it can get damaged so this one I just wash it with water soap and water like what I have the other one this and this one is also smaller because our kitchen table is small next I have the some of the stuff for kitchen I bought cloth um, napkins because I always buy um, paper napkins my husband uses a lot so this one is smaller so I liked it and then you can hang it I might have to put a place to hang this and then I can just wash it afterwards I might cut this the tags off it comes in three um, colors for for the handle so two each green red and blue napkins they are how much I get rid of my old napkins I did not really use it it's only four dollars for all six so eventually I will have to stop um, using my um, paper napkins and change it with this and then I got an apron I have an old apron that I only use for um, cleaning my hands it's a little bit fancier let me get that this one is a simple design and I might use it as a pattern to make uh, more aprons this is my old apron that I haven't really used <laughs> I just use it to uh, wipe my hands And then I have, I bought a um, bathroom towel. This one has some nice handle and then pretty design, birds, tropical birds, so kind. I got a shower curtain this one it says it's a liner but you can actually just use it as a curtain if you want I bought this one because I wanted a white one I have a curtain shower curtain that um, has a design so I bought this one to go with um, my um, white bath um, mat this is smaller they have a really nice fluffy one there for $16 but I got this one because it's smaller and I have a small bathroom I got what else this one is the um, canvas bag it's $1.50 when you shop at IKEA they don't give you any plastic bags but you can uh, wrap your um, glass uh, items in paper which they provide but they don't have bags so I get this one so I can put some some of my stuff here otherwise I just dump everything in the back seat so this one try a taste of Sweden so the other one it's um, a stamp I think this was for five dollars each so 
before I get to for ten dollars. I um, bought this before, but I gave some away. I only have about three left. I used it for um, stamping my students' um, work, especially um, when I was working with um, my husband in science. It has um, a ghost, sun, flower, heart, frog, and a d dog paw. So this is going to go to my uh, nephew, Jacob. Uh, his parents can uh, motivate him to get his work done and stamp it. And the other one I get for myself. So I have another set. Okay, I think the only um, other ones that uh, I bought that is not here is the drink. The lingonberry drink, which I um, got um, for my um, to eat with my Swedish meatballs, and then the uh, salmon. Hold on, I get the salmon. This is the salmon package that they have. It says it's farmed. I usually buy uh, wild caught uh, salmon, but uh, I figured I can try uh, salmon from uh, Sweden. Okay, that's it. And so, um, how much do you think did I spend for all of this? Uh, I can probably. <coughs> spend less than that if I'm in the Philippines but I, at least I did not um, only get stuff that I needed and going to send some of my old stuff to the Philippines okay thank you for um, watching guys see you again next time oh I forgot <laughs> one more this is the lead lamp I think LED lamp is only one dollar. This is for my lamp. I needed a, a lamp. I usually get the my bulbs at the bulbs at the Costco, but since I was there, it was only a dollar, so I got it. Hey, thank you. Till next time.